Sang my first show tune when I was just three. My mother knew why go far. I've been a show queen since way before Glee. Now I'm a Broadway star. Well, not exactly, but my friend has a friend who knows Adina Menzel. Well, you know, I mean, sort of. So things are happening, you'll see. But till my ship comes in, I've got a lot to tell you. Let's start chewing the scenery with you. Welcome to chewing the scenery with me. Turn off your cell phones. Welcome to this edition of CTS News. I'm Randy Rainbow. We'd like to begin, of course, by going right to this. Also in CTS News, Adina Menzel is batting a thousand these days, and on July 15th, she'll sing the national anthem at this year's MLB All-Star Game, set to air on Fox. Menzel will also perform the Bob Dylan hit Forever Young as part of a ceremony honoring all-star teachers from around the country. Players from the American and National Leagues will then interrupt the Adina Menzel concert to play basketball. Sorry, football. It was recently announced that Cats, the iconic Andrew Lloyd Webber musical, would be making a revamped return to London's West End this December. Lloyd Webber told the press he was adding a hip-hop flavor to the new revival by making the character of Rum Tum Tugger a street cat who raps. What a great idea, said 2006. In related news, the character of Grizabella will also twerk through the song memory. And another beloved musical that could be eyeing a Broadway return, Sideshow, which tells the story of conjoined twins who became famous stage performers in the 1930s, is currently enjoying a successful run at the Kennedy Center in Washington, D.C. Randy? Thanks, Randy. The original production of Sideshow opened in 1997, closing after only 91 performances. Sources tell us, however, that this latest reimagining from director Bill Condon could transfer to Broadway as early as this fall. Randy? Thanks, Randy. That was fun. I always have fun when you're around. Okay, that's enough. Okay. Also in CTS News, Rosie O'Donnell has officially signed on to return to The View for the show's 18th season. Along with the announcement that Sherry Shepard and Jenny McCarthy would not be returning, has come much speculation over who will fill their seats on the panel. The New York Post recently reported two Broadway icons who are apparently being considered. Broadway and mainstream superstar Adina Menzel and Bernadette Peters, who is of course known for her outspoken political views. And joining us now on the phone is Bernadette Peters herself. Bernadette, thank you for calling in. Is it true you're considering taking a job on The View? Oh, yes. Well, you know, we've never really heard any of your opinions on any prominent political issues, you know, other than Stephen Sondheim and dogs. So I thought that maybe we would take this time now to introduce a new rapid fire segment we're calling Hot Topics with Bernadette Peters. Bernadette, do you support the legalization of same-sex marriage? If I, 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 I guess, maybe. I mean, I have Is global warming affecting our environment? Um, uh, Do you support I, increased gun control? I, well, I mean, Where do you stand on abortion? Um, yeah. Is Lindsay Lohan relevant anymore? Um, <laughs> and finally, where do you stand on foreign policy issues? I mean, should the government decrease military spending? Him but his eyes on your thine beautiful. Him but his eyes I can't get older. I'm still the princess. Him but his eyes.